Hi there and welcome back. Um, so we're carrying on with the envelope journals and um, I'm just looking. So one, two, three, four, five. This is part seven. Okay, so um, when we finished off the last video, uh, we'd stuck the, the fronts and backs on. And I was just going to um, sew it off camera, which I have. So that's the one with the padded envelope. And I was a little bit worried about this. I thought, oh, is it, you know, when we're going to end up with like a puffy uh, part? Uh, but no, it's it's lovely. And I love the feel of it. Um, so that's that one. And that's that one. So I think that's finished those off nicely. So I was looking at uh, the pieces that I'd made and I've kind of put them in you know provisionally um in the orangey brown one um and I've got enough pieces for this one I hadn't quite got oh I do need to make one of the notepads and the little bits put the bits of ephemera in to go with this one and i don't know what i'm putting on the front i've not, not even thought about that to be honest and the blue one um i was short just a couple of pieces so i got a few of those um mushroom pieces uh what i did with the william morris paper and I think they go with, with it lovely. I don't know if there's two or three um, pieces that I'd put in. I think that's one there. And I think there's another one. Is that it? Yes. Oh, and that one. So I've put four pieces in. Which I think that goes with it uh, lovely. Because we've obviously got the William Morris paper there. Um, and then we've got that and I'm going to have that on the front. So maybe, and I've got this. So I wonder if to do to do this one. Um, I'm going to stick the front and, and the back in because I don't think that's going to make a massive difference when I'm uh, sewing, sewing it in. So let's get these down. I'm going to use the Fabri-Tac because this is... Um, quite a glossy paper so I can see the sew lines there so I want to kind of middle middle it up I'm going to stick the whole thing down um yeah I'm going to stick the whole thing down I am right at the end of this glue hopefully yep I'll have enough Okay, let's just pop, pop that in there. Just bring it to me a little bit, just to. Yeah, I think that looks, looks straight. So that's that piece. Then this piece, I'm gonna do this with a tacky glue. I'm just going to go around here. And this bit. Okay. And put this in the corner but I'm just going to Give it a, a, a gap. That's right. So let me just hold that down a second. Oh, let's just put that white there. Me close. Oh dear. Anyway, it's it's been a morning today. I don't even <laughs> don't even think I want to talk about it. Might randomly start talking about it. Um, in a bit. Anybody see where my lid's gone? So yeah, if I'm if I appear uh, more potty than, than usual, 
um, that's why. It's just been one of those. Oh, I've said too much now. I haven't said. I need to. I need to tell you. Um, I don't do my shopping. <clears throat> In the last couple of weeks, I've had it through Amazon because they've partnered with uh, Morrison's. Um, and the first two orders, absolutely fabulous. Brilliant service, uh, free delivery because I'm prime. Um, it's all in lovely paper bags. Everything's really chilled. Nice long dates on. Um, but this morning, the delivery was two hours. And I kept looking on the map and the, it kept saying, you are next, you are next. Um, and the delivery driver was still in the same location so you can like contact the delivery driver rank him no no answer um and then you like request a call back um and then i rang customer well i didn't ring it. it's like you talk to him through your through your phone like a text um and so i'm not going to put any of these in until i've sewn them and what I'm going to do is take them out, but keep them in the order that I've took them out, um, just to make it easier for for when I put them back in. And um, yeah, it was 20 minutes on this text thing. That drove me absolutely mad. Um, and then it was like... Oh, yes, we can see that it wasn't delivered. Um, you know, oh, we're really sorry, blah, blah. I'm like, yeah, yeah, whatever, fine. Um, you know, can you give me a time when when it can be re-delivered? Oh, well, we deliver up till 11 o'clock. It's, it's obviously still, still, you know, with the driver. Um, so it could come any time. Like, I can't... I've, got things to do i need to go out um so i cancelled the order so not only have you wasted the time doing the order two hours waiting for the order because i wanted to to film um i'm going to ink around this front one why i'm nattering um yeah so i've like been hanging about i could have really done with a bath and washed my hair this morning but instead, I've just got got dressed because the delivery was to nine and eleven. So like you've got that kind of nine till eleven, thinking, oh, is it gonna come? And then obviously two hours after that, just hanging, hanging about. Uh, you know, don't get in the bath or move. Um. So I've just said, oh, cancel it. Oh, you know, they're going to they're gonna credit me with a £10 gift voucher. I mean, whippy doodle. Four hours of my life and 20 minutes on this chat. And they're going to give me a £10 voucher. Right, so nothing's happening on there because the pieces are just being put down. I don't want to cover um, any more of it. I'm really liking the, the colour behind it. So... Not gonna do anything to them. Just go around these blue ones a little bit. So it still means um you know I've got no shopping and I didn't order the shopping because I didn't need it. <laughs> I ordered it because because I needed it. Um and now I'm that fed up. Um I really don't want to think about having to go shopping, but I'm obviously gonna have to go shopping. Um, and it's Ryan's day off today. He's gone to the hairdressers, well, to the barbers. Right, I'm going to do some stenciling. Um, and what am I going to do? I think I might do some script stamping. Um, let's just have that to the side. So, I'm going to... What colour is this? This is the orangey browny one, isn't it? No, this is the bluey greeny one. So I'm going to have the gold, the brown. And a bit of the rhubarb stalk. And I'm just going to put some random um, 
stamping on. Like so. I don't know. I think I prefer it stenciled. Needs to be a bit more random, don't it? Yeah, that's a lot better. Okay. Right, so that's that. Let's um, mix it, mix it up. So yeah, we've had that, and then um, I've kind of said um, to Ryan about should we perhaps think about um, going out to eat. Uh, Christmas day this year because uh, obviously the first Christmas without my mum and it's my mum's birthday on Christmas day um, <clears throat> and I not I have to work on Christmas Eve and I have to work on Boxing Day it's part of our um, contract because uh, we have a big big sale so Christmas Eve we're prepping for it and then Boxing Day is is the sale um, I'm actually contemplating leaving there before you know because um, yeah I mean I hate doing it anyway obviously because it's like 7 o'clock before you get home Christmas Eve then you know, if you're cooking Christmas dinner and all the rest of it, you've... I mean, it, it's hard work for the person who, who cooks dinner, I think. Um, you know, I tend to spend the whole day in the kitchen. Um, and then you could be on an early boxing day, which is, I think, I think they open at six. It's something ridiculous. Um... So then on Christmas Day, whatever time you're working, you're thinking, um, you know, I've got to go to work tomorrow. And if you're on it early, it's like you're counting the hours down. Um, and then, you know, I'm thinking just on top of um, my mum and stuff, I really can't bear it this year, um, having to, to work. Like I say, I hate doing it anyway. But anyway, we'd said about um, maybe having Christmas dinner, dinner out, because it's only me, Ryan and, and Alana. Um, my middle daughter goes to her partner's um, mum and my oldest daughter has it at home with her partner and, and the children. Um, So, and then, you know, you've got all that shopping, all that prepping and all that cooking <laughs> mess and and stuff. Um, so, anyway, we'd said yes. And I looked in um, it's a couple of restaurants, what um, I like. And nobody had got the Christmas menus up. So, I was off wondering, you know, is anybody doing it? Because, uh, you know, there's still restrictions on um, and things like that. Or I thought maybe it's already booked out. Anyway, I had another look this morning and the booking things still uh, has gone up now. Um, and the full menu is on. But um, there's no talk of um, what's gluten-free. Um, is gluten-free an option because it is a place that I do go to that are pretty uh, good at um, they even do a pie if you ring beforehand they'll make a, you're a gluten free pie but um, yeah with the restrictions um, a lot of places stopped doing gluten free because um, they just didn't have the space to do it um, so anyway I've emailed them and um I've gone through like the booking thing and um, it looks as if there's not many um, slots left. So I keep refreshing my emails to see if they've emailed me back because I don't want to book it 
and then I'm saying no, you know, unfortunately we can't uh, cater uh, for that this time. Um, so yeah, I just feel like I'm, that's wasted a lot of my time today. Um, and there's something else which I forgot. So, oh yeah, and then I started filming and I was waffling for about 10 minutes and realised the camera um, has stopped filming um, because my memory was full. So yeah, one of those days. Um... But, um, it, it's hard isn't it I think you know when you start off, off having one of those days instead of just being like oh it's just one of those things everything's fine you know um, I get a bit oof, oof about it and then everything seems to go, go wrong and I think it's because you've obviously then not you, me <laughs> have then got a bit of an attitude um, so everything does feel like it's it's going, going wrong. So, yeah, I feel a bit fed up today. And like I say, I originally didn't want to go shopping. Um, and I still don't want to go shopping. And I'm going to have to. I don't drive. Um, like I say, it's Ryan's day off today. So, it's either go today or reorder somewhere else, which again, I can't bear. Um or just suck it up and and go shopping <laughs> which i'm gonna have to have to do otherwise it's gonna be let's live off takeout meals for the next few few days right so that's all inked any more blue papers oh a couple more Oh, I don't know if that's made me feel better or worse. <laughs> just like, just ranting about it. Oh. Yeah, I'm going to say in this, there's a lot of paperwork and things obviously to sort out uh, with my mum and, and stuff. And, you know, some things are taking a lot of time and attention and, oh... I just feel like I'm just waiting uh, for for things all of the time. You know, I'm waiting for phone calls or I'm waiting for letters or um, all the rest of it. So, I'm quite happy uh, with that. I don't think it needs trimming down any. So, for me, that's ready uh, to, to sew in. Um, I want to put that down now. I know after I'm going to think, why did I do that? But um, I just want to do it. Because <laughs> it's going to make me happy. <laughs> it will make me happy. Um, I don't know if I dare say them in today, you know. Because, um, yeah, it, it, it could all go terribly, terribly wrong. Even though, you know, it's only a basic three hole pamphlet stitch I think probably everything what could go wrong would go wrong anyway stop being negative Nancy sorry to any Nancy's out there right I think I want that just over a bit Okay, I'm going to get some string and put some string in that. So, let's cut that. And that's that. You know what? I'm going to stick the um, ephemera the in. Otherwise, if I'm not going to sew it on screen and I'm not going to stick the ephemera in, um, what am I going to do? <laughs> what did I turn the camera on for? Let's just uh, take that on. <laughs> yeah, otherwise, it's <laughs> a bit, bit of a waste of time. I think down that side, I might have burlap uh, down there because I do think that that will go really nice um, with this one. I think the green one... 
I might go lace, uh, like crochet trim. Oh, don't. So, right. I think that's fine. That's fine. Okay, so I'm going to start and, and stick these in. So, so I don't need to do it with a cover on. Just having a think what I can put at the front of, front of that other one. I need to use the art glitter for this. So, um, okay. Any idea what I did with the, with the little tags? Yeah, they're there. I'll just put those there. I won't put the big one in. Yeah, so then this will be the back one, won't it? Now we do, I want that. And I'm going to want something else on this page, aren't I? Hmm, what shall... I mean, do I just want to... Just put it on, you know, not as much as that. Or do I need something, something else on the page? I don't know. I really don't know. Um... See, I think everything that I've got autumnal wise um, possibly won't go go with that. just two two squares on there isn't it well two rectangles got a paper clip that goes the wrong way obviously <laughs> of course it does I've got some brown ruffle Maybe that would be nice. Turn that. I don't think it adds to it or, um, or takes it away. Right, I'm going to stick it down. Because uh, if, if I find something else, it, it'll probably go, go here. I might just do some um, collage. Um, And make some like clusters onto the onto the page. Well, so I can do do that after. It's not like I'm putting anything underneath um, this. 
So I'm going to go bottom corner ash. Okay. Now, let me just put that over there. And put that in there. And that just needs some, it needs a card in there and a card in there, which I'm going to have to make, make something up. But I'll do that off, off camera, the final, uh, going, going through it. So then we've got a doily. Let's move that cup over there. Then I've got this page. And if that opens that way. So, and I'm going to just, in fact, I'm going to go in the middle and then I can put a card um, going through it. So, oh dear, I don't know why this glue is so uh, runny. It's a new one. Um, oh my goodness me. Right. That's that's in the middle. Then that's at the the back. And so that's gonna go there. That's a folding folding out. So I'm gonna glue glue that down. I might it's gonna go inside. Okay. So that will open out. Yeah, that's fine because it's on on that side. Yeah. I'm gonna say I'd done a writing space at the back, but um I think you're best to sometimes cover cover the back. Um and then obviously it's done done if, if you need it. Uh, sorry about that, I just had to pause Ryan had just got back from the um hairdressers so i've done that one and my goodness which one was it oh yeah now i've just been um having a moan at um about it <laughs> oh dear it's so funny really it's so um Oh, well, you know, what's the matter? And I said, uh, well, do you want the short version? Or the, like, you know, he did the very concerned, um, oh, what's the matter? And then when I said, do you want the short version or the long version? He's like, well, I don't really want the extended version. <laughs> Which means you can tell me all about it from, you know, start to finish, but phew, don't go deep into it. So anyway, I, I just ignored that and, <laughs> and I've just told him everything. And so I'm totally fed up. Uh, I still don't feel any better. So we've decided to forget all about shopping for today. Uh, it can take me tomorrow after work. So um, I'm going to get to it. He's just nipped to Ikea to get a couple of... Um, <coughs> um boxes um because there's some more things i want to bring back from my mum's this weekend um at christmas decorations um so i need those big clear boxes same as what my christmas decorations are in 
um, so they can stack stack up because I haven't really got room for them but if they stack up um, I have got room for them so he's just gone back down there um, and then he's going to take Colin for a walk so I think I'm going to well I'm going to film this <laughs> I don't think uh, I am going to film this and then I think I'm going to go and have some well I'm going to make a cup of coffee have something no I don't want something to eat I've had something to eat I was just thinking perhaps I'm hungry um, I didn't sleep very well last night I think that's what my main issue is um, I was awake till 2 o'clock then I was awake at 4 o'clock um, and then I got up at just gone up past 7 so yeah I'm not very good on um, not getting enough sleep it does make me very grouchy um, so yeah I think I'll have a bath put my pyjamas on I might say to everybody me and Ryan and Alma you can just get your own tea just have some soup or some beans on toast something like that and um, I might just go and watch some telly in my room yeah, see I don't really want to go to sleep today because I'd rather get an early early night and then we'll just start tomorrow again new day Yeah, I'm definitely going to need some kind of page decoration. But, um, yeah, for the minute, I just can't think. So, this is fine. And that will be uh, sewn, sewn in. But because I'm only doing a three-hole pamphlet stitch, it's only going to catch in one hole. So, what I am going to do is I'm going to machine down here and attach this to this page. Um, and I have reinforced it one way. I think I might reinforce it the other way. I'm sick of this glue keep splodging out on my table. I just, I don't need it, do I? Oh. Right. So, yes, I'm going to do that. Um, I'm going to put that down there just to give it a bit more um, stability. Not stability. It's not stability, is it? What? Um, I can't think of the word. It's like stability. Strengthen it. Which is stability, isn't it? I think it's you just I'm just not saying it in the right kind of context. I think that's what it is. Right, let's pop that down. There. And, uh, just cut that off. This doesn't need glue. <coughs> glue in it's um it's quite strong. This tape is. So that's that. So that is all the pieces in for that one. So I need to sew that envelope in and then sew the signature in and then we'll come back tomorrow uh, or later today but I'll be filming it tomorrow because I'm obviously filming this um, I think I'm only about a week and a half in front now uh, with videos so yeah we'll come back make any uh, extra tags that we need for pockets and think about some uh, ephemera do need to put uh, two holes in because uh, that's just going to be tied together. Again, that's not a job I want to do today because I think if I'm not if I'm not fully with it, um, you can just make a mess, can't you? So, and them to go with that. I think it it's going to be lovely. Um, so that's a kind of um, thing, isn't it? And we need to do that. So let's do the same with this one then. 
um, if you don't mind. I mean, you don't have to. You don't have to watch. Um, I never know sometimes what to do off camera and and what not to. So I tend to just do unless I'm just doing a project. So you know, from start to finish on my own. Um, is that going to look funny? That side. Yeah, I, I prefer it that side. So that will just have to open, open in. That's not, it's not a biggie, is it? Right, let's um, get this down. Yeah, because I think, um, you know, if you're crafting, um, sometimes when I'm crafting, I'm only actually listening uh, to the person. So sometimes I'm glad that it's not something that I actually properly need need to watch. Uh, sometimes I just want a bit of um, a bit of company, or just to um, listen to to somebody's update on on what's happening with them. You know, if it's if it's someone um, who I really like and and stuff, I'm just interested to hear what they what they're on about. Um, so, so yeah. <laughs> Anybody who's waiting for anything exciting to happen, it's not. It's not happening on this on this one. So, you can come back later today for the next edition, and that's going to be really exciting. <laughs> it's all going to happen. Uh, but but for you, ones who are just happy to. Just hear me moan, <laughs> moan, groan, um, stick things upside down and inside out. Then this is this is the video for you. Um, and I must say, you know, thank you all for your continued support and, and bearing with me through through this time. It's um, yeah, it's very very difficult. Okay. So I'm not going to stick that in yet. Ooh, um, put that just to one side a minute, <clears throat> and let's start one page at a time. Oh, they're in the right, the right place anyway. So really do like this pocket. The two two joined together and then this big one but it actually looks as if that's you know kind of a library uh pocket i really do like that i have messaged lorna and told her what a beautiful kit kit it is um, i've actually sent her some some photos of some of the pieces uh that i've been making and um, to show her what what i've been doing uh, but yeah, it's a beautiful kit. I've really enjoyed it. Um, and I, I've loved that, well, one, it's so big. Um, and like I say, I've probably saved over 10 pieces uh, for my winter project. So I've got those all ready. And um, yeah, the, it's made two quite different looking, looking journals. Uh, or if you wanted to have done a bigger journal, um, I think next year when I use it, I will mix mix the two and just do one big journal. But um, I've got so many um, projects that I wanted to do. Um, I've just not got um, the time to do, um, you know, something something massive. So. I'm going to start full, like beginning, I don't know, when did I start, start at, what are we on now, September, so end of August, I think I'm going to start it next time, like right at the beginning of August, maybe at the end of July, at least go on to them kind of darker woodlands um, in July, because it is my favourite, favourite time, uh, colour wise and and stuff. It's my favourite time weather wise and cosy wise and all the rest of it. And visually, because I love the trees in, in autumn. Just 
want to make sure that that's going to go. Go in once it's dry. Some to have put that down a little bit funny. That's it. Right, let me just clear that again. It had, um, I don't know, it had somehow like glued glued onto itself. Let's try that. Might end up just having to shave shave a little bit off. Right, I'll leave it to totally dry. Then if it doesn't fit in, I will just uh, shave a little bit bit off. So that's that double page. <laughs> okay, so then we've got the. thing jiggy now this one I do feel like I'm gonna do a collage around around there so what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave that side open uh, a little bit because I just feel that I'm gonna want some kind of collage going around it I am going to have to um, I think print some more of the kit, kit out. But I've been trying not to uh, print out as much kit because I used to, uh, you know, print a kit out X amount of times and then be always end up with some left over. Um, and to try to not have any left over, I kind of have to do less than I think I'm going to want. Right, does this go on the back of there then? I don't know what I'm actually putting behind that. So I'm going to have that like that and then I think I would have something going down the down the side so just put some glue there and put that out there I did leave some uh, baby wipes out to dry. Like I said, I was gonna. I don't like the feel of them when they're dry, though. <clears throat> right, so <clears throat> that is that. It's a little bit crooked. I've just kind of pulled it down now I've got this crease but it's not wonky anymore so I might put another leaf on there but I'll do that when I do, do the page so <clears throat> that's that one what's next <laughs> oh. Need to stamp these, don't you? But I'll do that off, off camera. So that one's going to flip out like so. So I probably need to get some <coughs> navy blue or 
something lace out and probably print some of the um I might print the fussy cuts off again and maybe do them uh, two to a page and then I can use those as, as decoration so that's that one then I'm going to glue that one down down here like so Okay, I'll just put that in like so. This one, when I stamp it, I'm going to put, um, use the orange. Um, so that opens that way. So, I can have that in there. In the middle, because then I can have something um, going down, down there. I forgot what I was saying. Oh, um, stamp it. Orange, gold, and brown, I think. I'll do it with the script stamp again. But yes, yeah, so I'm going to have to think about... Um, I think I've got some material that... Um, I could perhaps do, do a ruffle with because I do feel like I need some ruffle. So this I'm going to um, glue on three sides. That's one of the decoupage ta tags that I did. Yeah, it is handy having this dry wipe. So, so that will pop in like so. Like that. Obviously it needs something over the top. It's on the other side. I think I'm just going to... that one is that it then oh that's it right lovely so <clears throat> why I'm off camera I'm going to um, I'm gonna stamp this one um, yeah I'm gonna have to make this smaller Yes, I'm going to stamp in this one and I'm going to sew them, sew them both, both in. Now this does step out, but I really like this <clears throat> with this one because um, <clears throat> the edges have got this brown down them. I kind of like the, the look of it, so I'm going to leave them like that. And I've got plenty of room in here, so it's not like anything's going to be sticking out. Now, let's just have a quick <coughs> thing, excuse me, <coughs> about what I could put on the front. I have got, I think they're going to be too big. I really like this. So, let me cut it out. It's a fabric. Um... I'm guessing it's sticky. It's quite thick. It's like on a linen. Oh no. More like, um, oh, I don't know. Like a heavy canvas. It's 
quite tough to, to actually cut. Right. <coughs> so let's just ink, ink around this. Just get rid of that, that white. Oh, I love that. You know, I think that with, you know, a biggish bow there and then some trim there. I really like that. I'm feeling like that's all it needs. Just let some... Um, <coughs> if I use a quite thick... Um, Where's that gone? Sorry, I'm just um, looking for that thick, thick lace, thick, thick lace. Um, just I'll put it back. Because <laughs> that's not what I was thinking at all. That's not thick enough. Um, yeah, so you would have about that much on one side um, and then that in the middle. Oh, yeah, I really like that. But I'm wondering if something needs to to come out of it, if that makes any sense. I'll tell you what I have got. I've got some in here. Um, I wonder about... Um, having some some leaves coming out. I don't want too orange. Oh yeah, I like that. So, no, I like to put it like that. I don't think I want any red. Definitely want some orange. Yes. I wonder if that would be better. Too much on top. Imagine if just something like that. I don't think I've got a double orange. Oh, that's nice. Just dropped. Mm. Yeah, I am thinking something like that. And maybe putting this, I don't know, maybe some tissue underneath or um, some card. So I'm going to leave those out. Um, I'll make my mind up and I'll do that. And like I say, I'll stamp it, I'll sew them in. And then we'll spend the last um, video on um, putting some decoration because, you know, we can stick some leaves on pages and, um, you know, I've got some frames, I've got fussy cuts and, and things. Uh, I do feel like I need to make a fabric ruffle or something so that's it for now um thank you for bearing with me or if you've turned off well you're not here this bit <laughs> uh, so yeah thank you thank you very much i do feel a little bit a little bit more chilled now breathe <laughs> so i shall see you later today which will be tomorrow for me hold on i'm just thinking That could be nice, you know. Let's 
Sam. And then maybe some some of this. Um, obviously, I'm not going as as chassis as that, but yes, I think that's going to be going to be it. Maybe I don't. Yeah, I do like that cheeky bit of orange. Okay, so that is it. <laughs> I'm not tricking. I'm going. So I'll see you later. Bye. Oh, I've got this. So I want to try and make a ruffle out of that. Okay, bye.